This is the new Comandante X25 Trail Master. It's the only second coffee hand grinder released after the success of the iconic Comandante C4. In this video, I want to answer most, if not all questions you might have about it. Disclaimer, Comandante is a sponsor of European Coffee Show. Now, to make this video, we used Trailmaster for a couple of months and even traveled to Germany to visit Comandante office and ask the founder some important questions. But before we get into all the details, we got an extra box to open. Seems to we got our test grinder without it, as you can see, and we wanted to show you the unboxing experience. the body of the grinder, some beautiful stickers, certification, instruction, and we have the handle and the knob. Listen. Okay, so our grinder is ready for grinding. Surprise, surprise, since we already have one Trailmaster in the studio, we decided to give away one that we just unboxed to you. We'll share the details at the end of this video, so don't miss it out. Okay, Comandante X25 Trailmaster was designed to be an outdoor hand grinder. But the truth is that any hand grinder is by definition already much more portable than electric grinder, right? But Comandante C40, which is our benchmark for hand grinder, always felt like a design object, something you want to put on the shelf rather than throwing it into your backpack. Trailmaster was designed differently, lighter weight and more robust, so let's look at the details. The first thing that you will notice while holding it is the silky texture and feel of the grinder. Thanks to the polygon design, it rests very well in your hand. Each one of the polygons reflects the light in a slightly different way, creating an optical illusion that there are different colors. The Comandante logo is featured on both sides of the grinder and is raised to give an extra grip while operating it. At the start, it felt a little sharp, but I got used to it and now I appreciate the strong grip. At the moment, it comes in dune color version. It's matte and pairs very well with the classic wooden Comandante knob. There are two more colors designed and in making, and that's asphalt black and forest green. Grinding seems also very familiar, and the movements are more fluid and smooth. When you close the grinder with the rubber lid, it's also pretty water resistant. Thanks to that, you can just rinse it under the water when it gets dirty, or it's not a problem if you are outside and start to rain and your backpack gets wet. I think there are two very distinct aspects of Trailmaster the polygon design of the body and the material that was used to manufacture Trailmaster's case. Since we had a chance to talk to the founders, that's what we wanted to know about. First, we asked about the design process. Obviously it all starts with a sketch. Um, and then you go on, on the computer and you do it in 3D. After we did that, we started 3D printing them, like the shelf. That was the first 3D print that actually works. So that's a grinder that you could use from the visuals. We got to the point where we liked it quite fast. And the inside, that's the tricky part because it has, you have to be able to manufacture it. Um, that, that is 100% what my dad does. And as we learned, it took Comandante several years to fine tune all the details and pick the right material that is lightweight, extremely durable and also food safe to pass all requirements of burn brown. The main body is what we call the Q-tip, reinforced, high-tech, a techno-polymer, which we be used in, like, for, for gearboxes, shafts. And the polymer is also, it's a type of nylon, which is a double-chain nylon, which is even more compacting. At the end of the day, when people buy it in their hand, they have to be happy. That's the idea, I and mean, it's the commandante way. Now it's time to look at what are some of the key differences between X25 Trailmaster and C40. Trailmaster weighs around 422 grams and it makes it considerably lighter than standard C40 MK4 which weighs about 577 grams. These 150 grams doesn't sound as a huge difference, but you can feel it in your hands. It's also taller but at the same time slimmer with a smaller radius. 
almost 1 cm thinner and around 1 cm tall than C40. The maximum capacity of brining at once is 25 to 28 grams, depending on the type and density of the coffee beans, whereas Commandante C40's capacity is about 40 grams. Since the material of the body is different, stainless steel for C40 and polymer for Trailmaster, also the sound of grinding is different. A quite big difference is the jar bottom container for ground coffee. In the classic C40 you have a glass or polymer jar that can be used as a container to store your coffee. On the contrary, the Trailmaster's bottom is made from the same material as the main body and there is no lid or cover available now. Trailmaster also houses the same nitro blade burr set as all Commandante grinders. Therefore, you can expect the same quality of grind but also the grind setting will match with click dial-in mechanism. The access to the grind setting dial is different though. There is less space in Trailmaster and I needed some time to figure out the right positions of fingers when changing the grind setting or cleaning the grinder. Even though there is the same burr set, the grind experience is slightly different, which is probably caused by different material and more narrow body. What's also quite handy is that you can swap most parts and accessories between Trailmaster and C40. You can keep using all knobs, ball bearings, washers or axles you already have from C40 also for Trailmaster. It's not a problem to swap your favorite knobs or use red clicks for espresso grinding. I guess the last thing to compare is the price. I think everybody was hoping for cheaper grind from Commandante. Trailmaster is cheaper, but just a little bit. The goal for the company was to create the grinder with a different use case, but the same quality, which means price couldn't go that much lower. So the key question here is, do I need Trailmaster? Probably not. Do I want Trailmaster? Yes. If you already have Commandante Grinder, there is no need to get Trailmaster unless the use case is compelling enough for you. Which means you want to have a high performance hand grinder in more compact, lighter wave form. Now, how to join the giveaway and how to get a chance to win Commandante X25 Trailmaster? First, you need to download our mobile app from App Store or Google Play. It's an app that helps you to find specialty coffee shops all around Europe, but it's also a platform we are building to communicate with our community. Then go to the menu, pick support app and invite us for coffee. We decided we wanted to reward our biggest supporters with these exclusive giveaways and we expect at least one per month. Then you go to the About Project section and first item should be Giveaway. That will take you to the sign up form. If you can't see the giveaway button, make sure you updated the mobile app or that you made the donation. And that's it. Thanks for watching the video. Good luck in the giveaway and let us know if you have any questions about Trailmaster. We'll do our best to answer them below the video. Thank you. Bye-bye.